Hey guys, uh, get my full unfiltered show the way you can't here on YouTube by visiting thecomicsgym.com. It's free and totally uncensored. In our libs eating libs segment tonight. Uh, some woman. Brett? Brett Baker tweeted. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought this was, <laughs> I think we did a story. Was that yesterday when I did the Indiana Jones thing? Yeah. Wow, I'm very tired. Yeah. Yes, this is a tweet from Brett Baker, whoever the fuck that is. Uh, Bill Maher, people, you know, he's, he's being asked by his fans, well, you're going after the left. What pussies you guys are on the left, by the way. He's, he's oh, you're coming after us. You're supposed to walk lockstep, goose step with the rest of us Nazis. See, Bill's finally waking up, but what he doesn't realize is he helped create this fucking mindset that he hates so much. I want to like Bill Maher. Everybody calls him an asshole, and I, I hear that all the time myself. Uh, he's one of those guys, like I said, when, you, when, the, when, the, when the, your team plays a rival team and you hate that one guy on the other team, but you wouldn't mind him in your uniform on your team. That's how I feel about Bill Maher. Uh, but he's wrong about everything because he's a fucking lib. He's been in Hollywood too long, smoking fucking weed and banging Asian hookers. That's what I like about him. Some of those hookers are female. Uh, well, here's a clip of him uh, from his show that, again, I will argue his HBO show, which has been on forever and it always had good numbers, helped create this fucking mindset with all Republicans are retards and all conservatives are square, blah, blah, blah. Year after year, you had congressmen on, these stiffs that nobody respects in the Republican Party, and you would massacre them in front of these asshole fans of yours. And um, you had Ann Coulter on, who, let's be honest, she could destroy you one-on-one, -on -one, but you dated her, so you still have her on. And remember when she said Donald Trump was the leading candidate and everybody laughed at you guys are always wrong about the big shit. But I digress. Let's play what he had to say. Uh, um, to me, when people say to me sometimes like, boy, you know, you go after the left a lot these days. Why? Oh. I'm like, because you're embarrassing me. <laughs> now they That's applaud. I'm going after the He's left. talking and about you. you. never did before because you're inverting things that I, I'm not going to give up on being liberal. This is what these teachers are talking about, that, that you're taking children and making them hyper aware of race in a way they wouldn't otherwise be. Pause. I mean, oh boy, is this great. You made, you helped, and a million other libs make this country hyper aware of race. And when we say slippery slope back then, Oh, you're paranoid. You're afraid of change in this country. Blah, 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 blah. Year after year, you made fun of white people being stupid, how racist this country was. And now it's coming back. to Now you're seeing it taken to its logical conclusion. And you don't like it because you're getting bit in the ass. How many times am I going to point that out, Bill? How many times am I going to say it? I mean, you gotta listen to me. Get this through your head, you. you. Never... Get this through your head, you Jew motherfucker, you. Go ahead. <laughs> I, I saw last night on the football game, uh, Alicia Keys saying, lift every voice and sing, which now I hear is called the Black National Anthem. Now, maybe we should get rid of our national anthem. Why? But I think we should have one national anthem. I think when you go down a road that where you're pause. having two different... See, he couldn't even leave that alone. He couldn't say, we have a national anthem that represents everybody. Sorry Snoop wasn't around when it was written, or whoever the fuck. This country was founded by white people. We're sorry again. So we should get rid of ours, and you don't like the black. We already have one. It's fine. And Alicia Keys is 99% white, by the way. I'm darker than she is. But boy, does she play up that black angle, because it was good for her career. Go ahead, Billy. For national anthems, colleges sometimes now have, many of them have different graduation ceremonies. Yes! For black and white. Yes! Separate dorms. Pause. This is what I mean. This is what the Democrat Party's been all about. That's how you've been voting for 30 years. What, did you just fucking wake up? He looks like an agent I had at William Morris. <laughs> Bill, Bill, wake up. This is the shit that we've been screaming about. This didn't just happen last night, overnight. 
It's been a steady push by the left, and you don't like its conclusion. Hey, guys, watch the full episode of The Nick DiPaolo Show uh, for free on Roku, Apple TV, Amazon Fire, Android, iPhone, Android Mobile, or on your computer for free by visiting thecomicsgym.com or downloading the Comics Gym app.